So I just wanted to show everyone um, Hannah's toddler room now. We moved her out of the crib when she was 21 months old, so about three weeks ago or so. Anyways, but um, we got her the Doc McStuffins bed because she loves Doc McStuffins, so that's what we redid her room in. Um, I changed the room up a bit, and some of the old things we kept from her room, just because they're so cute and I don't want to get rid of them. Um, not just yet, anyways. <laughs> um, so... Anyways, but we got this toy box, which um, was like $20 or $24 at Toys R Us, which we got a like 20% off discount because we did a coupon for that. So there's her little um, toy box. And it's wasn't full of toys at first, but now it is because I've moved some things from downstairs upstairs. Um, and you'll see she has like two little puppies here, this one and that one. And she did have one that she really loved, but unfortunately... Um, was lost at daycare. So those two were kind of a replacement. She likes the little one the best though. This one right there. Uh, we don't send her with um, the dog anymore to daycare just because we don't want him to get lost as well. We don't know really what happened to it. Um, and then you'll see all the decals along the wall here and we only, I think they were like 11 or $12, something like that. Um, and I just kind of put them all throughout um, I still have her name on the top of the wall up there, just because I didn't want to take it down, but it used to be over her crib. That was, like, kind of hard for me to, like, transition her from crib to toddler bed. We did it a little sooner with Ella, not with Hannah, though. <laughs> um, and then we've got her Doc McStuffins poster that never likes to stay on the wall, but we've got some, like, really strong tape now to hold it on. Um, we tried, like, a push pin, but the push pin wouldn't even go through the wall. I still have her bow holder that I made her when she was the baby before she was born and a picture frame that has never had any pictures in it yet, <laughs> which I need to put pictures in. Um, and then here's just another little decal. I still have her lamp and her picture frame, which never had any pictures in it, um, and her rocking chair because she still likes to be rocked to sleep even though she'll be two in June. Crazy to say, but... Um, it's like she's grown up so much faster, not grown up really, but just it's gone a lot faster with her than it has with Ella. Um, we have some more decals here, and this one says, all better. And there's some more decals over there. I just kind of scattered them all about. And then her changing table still, because she's not potty trained yet. When she's potty trained, it'll go too, but um, for now, I like it for the storage. We've got her diapers diapers down there and cloth diapers and then we've got her um like lotions and baby oils and I've got like I still I really love I don't know I showed this in a video when I was pregnant with her this um it's the booger sucker and it, it it's electric one I kind of I don't really take it out of the packaging but you can hear it it's by Grico and it's a nasal like electric nasal aspirator and I've got the other nasal aspirators down there too with Q-tips and her Destin cream and stuff. We actually use Miracle Cream with her because she um, responds better to that when she gets really bad rashes. Still have her um, wipe warmer, but we don't even plug it up anymore. It's just there for storage of the wipes. <laughs> um, and then I still have her decorations up here from when she was a baby baby. Um, I made that this flower arrangement when I was pregnant with her and got... All that stuff when I was pregnant with her. And she still has the same dresser, of course. That'll probably be her dresser, because Ella has one of her own now. And then a basket for shoes, which I need to, like, exchange out, because now it's getting to be spring. And so we'll probably switch out her shoes. And then this is her, um... Her Doc McStuffins growth chart little thing where the red is her and then the black is Ella. Because this was Ella's room, of course, before she came along. Um, so as you can see, I haven't taken a measurement since December 15th. The focus on the camera is kind of bad. <laughs> um, and then I just did one of Ella back in January, it looks like. This chart only goes up to like 37 inches. And I think right now she's right at around probably my guess 29 or 30 inches which 
She's 20, almost 22 months old. As you can see, Ella was 26 and a half months old before she even got to that 30 inch mark. So Ella will probably be a little taller than she is. I mean, Hannah will probably be a little taller than Ella is, but I'm not really sure. So um, she has like a few toys in here in her toy box. And then she has like her, um, her princess castle and the little clippity clop things we got her for Christmas, which she doesn't play a lot in here. She plays more in um, Ella's room. And then books down here in this little bin that I just, it was a bin that belonged to Ella on the changing table, which now I've replaced with those little monkey ones for the East Beach Jungle theme in here. I just kept those too. Anyways, and then like in her closet, I've, I've kind of gotten rid of some of the baby things, but some of the baby things are just kind of hanging out up there, like her bombo seat, her shopping cart cover, and I had an ergo with her when we went to Disney World back last October, I guess it was October of... Well, yeah, last October, October 2013. And a little music thing that went on her crib and stuff. So a lot of the baby stuff is still up there that I need to move out. Um, and then she's got her little quilted blanket there that my grandmother made her. And the other stuff's like downstairs stored. And um, then she's got her toddler bed set. This used to belong to Ella. It was a princess one. We sold our princess toddler bed. But I didn't want to sell the princess... Um, toddler set because just in case I would need to change it out in the middle of the night or something because she like threw up or peed or something um, and these are just like some hangers we have a billion hangers <laughs> um, right now I'm in transition like I said from doing her win getting her winter clothes out and putting her spring clothes in and so there's a couple springish type things and summer type things back here like this was Ella's um, spring dress one year I think that's a size 12 month though um, I don't know if it'll even fit her. I've gotten new spring dresses for them. Like, most of their dresses are in Ella's closet because she just has so much bigger of a closet. And then that's her little summer outfit that we got on clearance last year. And she has a little summer dress. A little Oshkosh dress. And there's some more winter clothes up for next year. But, yeah, I've got to move all this stuff out. I've got all the summer stuff already out. I just have to wash it. And then she's got, like, a couple more sleepers left that I kind of waited on um I really need to organize their clothes in the bins because I've got like a lot of clothes that are mixed up like 12 to 18 months stuff with six to nine and we go to sell that stuff it needs to be all in order um and I still have like her little drawer with stuff these are just like handmade blankets that are just kind of hanging out there and then I've got her um changing table like covers here and this was a crib mattress for the crib mattress but I just left them in there just because I didn't want them to get mixed up into everything else. And then she's got some more um, changing table. She's got five changing table things. And then these are some more cloth diapers down here. We have like Bomb Genius and Fuzzy Buns and um, just a lot of different ones that I've gotten with Ella and with her. These are Drabby's cloth diapers, which I didn't really like those because they didn't absorb as much as the other ones did. But anyways, I think I've shown my cloth diaper collection before in previous videos. And then just some odds and ends, diaper bags and stuff, old diaper bags that I just need to get rid of or sell. Um, I change my diaper bag just about every year just because I want something different. Um, so, anyways. But that's basically her room. I'll give you a a little mini tour of it one more time. Uh, I changed the curtains out too. They used to be lime green, pink, brown, and white. And I changed them out. And um, there's still the same like curtain rods up there, but I just changed the curtains out. There is her room. Oh, and her Dot McStuffins bag came from Toys R Us as well. We could not find it anywhere else. Especially when, like, everybody got their taxes back and they are going out shopping like we did. And, um, there was just none anywhere except for, um, the Toys R Us about an hour from us. We drove the hour to go get it. We could have ordered it online, but I really wanted it that day to, like, set it up and everything. It was no trouble finding the bed set that you see here. The bed set was, like, I think $40 and the bed was, like, $50, I think. So, anyways, but this is her new room. Thanks for watching.